down the toilet or down the drain. When you're done with dirty water, you want it gone. At KC Water, that's our duty. It's number one and number two on our minds all day. That dirty work is why KC Water returns your wastewater to the Missouri River cleaner than we found it. Let's take a little spin and show you how water works. After you finish your business in the bathroom, KC Water's work is just getting started. Wastewater leaves your house and goes through miles and miles of sewer pipe to one of KC Water's six wastewater treatment plants that treats an average of 88 million gallons of wastewater every day. When wastewater arrives, the pretreatment removes rocks, trash, and other debris. Then, fine sand is removed before the water flows to primary clarifiers, where most of the larger solids are separated. The remaining dissolved solids still need to be removed through a biological process. Next, it's time for water to be disinfected. Bleach is added to the water as it leaves the clarifiers. Finally, bisulfite is added to remove any bleach, and samples confirm that the water is perfectly clean. The pristine water is released back into the Missouri River, our natural resource that guarantees us a constant source of water. Casey Water takes pride in the mighty Missouri and monitors it constantly for any adjustments needed to our treatment. But what happened to the solids that got separated from your wastewater? They go into the solids process. They are pumped into a digester, where the biological process separates liquid and gas. The biogas is burned off, and the liquid is pumped to a bioland application system, where the solids wait to be used as fertilizer for corn, soybeans, or barley, which can be harvested for biofuel. So there you have it. That's what happens after you flush the toilet.